on guys welcome back to let's play mario and luigi dream team for the 3ds before we get started if you can hit that like button for me let's see if we can reach 500 likes if we can i will keep the mario and luigi dream team marathon going until completion you guys have earned yourself a bonus episode since the previous episode reached over 500 likes so you can expect that episode coming out later today but if you'd like to see the marathon continue then go ahead and leave a like on this video and we will keep it going anyways when we last left off we left off here on top of Dreaming Mount Page Magia. We finally made it to the summit. Today we're gonna to be taking on the boss of Dreaming Mount Page Magia. And I gotta say, I battled him for the first time last night and he was a lot more powerful than I thought he was gonna be. Um, my problem is I have like, I, I don't know, I just have a problem with like getting excellent hits. So I'm hoping that with the practice that I had yesterday that he won't be much of an issue for me today, but uh, I, I'm not really sure. But here's hoping, so don't judge me on my skills. I'm warning you that it's not gonna be good good and a lot of you guys are probably gonna pull your hair out uh, in, the, in, in the making of watching this video or something like that so uh, here we are Mount Page Imagine Summit ye who hath seized the summit thy muscles know no, not bounds I don't even know what that means but I think that's some like uh, olden I, I don't know what that is what is supposed to be some royal encrypting I guess uh, what is this that looks like a dog looks like an evil angry dog but it's not. It's actually a volcano. Oh, man. Uh oh. <laughs> Mario and Luigi climbing the mountain. They're so small, man. Oh, uh, Luigi having a little trouble there. But yeah, this is in fact the second uh, boss battle that we had in the that we're going to have in the Dream World. Are you well? Yeah, we're pretty well. <gasps> When did your voice become so hoarse? No. Uh oh. Who wakes me? This mountain, it lives! Hmm. Hey, it's just like the mountain in The Hobbit. In that case, we must find a way to make it erupt. If we go into erupting it, the dream portal might open. Oh man, that does not even sound good. If there is a freaking mountain that is like 50 times your size, not even, like probably like a thousand times your size, you do not want to piss it off and try to make it erupt. Um, so, yeah, so there's a Luigianary thing back here. So what we're going to do actually is we're going to go inside of this Luigianary and we're going to play as a tornado. Um, and the reason for that is because we need to do something. So with Mario, you're gonna actually try to hit these boxes onto like whatever that thing is. You know, I don't even know what it is. I think it's his eye. Oh man. Woo! And we hit it twice, and then we have to hit it one last time. Ah, oh, that's gonna suck. Ah! There's really no like certain pattern with the way they they move. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Ah, oh, come on. There we go. Wow, it actually took four hits. I thought I was doing it wrong. How dare you? Uh-oh. I would haul. I would just get out of there. I wouldn't even stand to watch this thing. I would bounce so fast that... That people would assume I'm a freaking ball. Luigi! Am I just imagining things? He's not sleeping as deeply. He's scared. He's having a nightmare. That's what. Whoa! We must flee this place quickly! Hurry, you too! Uh-oh. So if you're stuck inside of a dream world, I don't think pissing off the person that's in your dream, the person who's terrorizing your dreams, uh, w would help. If you're having a nightmare, you try to wake up, but in this situation, they can't wake up because there's no dreamy portal. So, they're pretty much screwed. Oh man, this is, this is gonna be great. I'm really nervous for this battle, to be honest. Like, I, I know for a fact I'm not gonna do as well, especially the fact that I'm recording this. Like, even on my own time when I play, and I'm not having to focus on narrating the video, I still do terrible. Uh, your return from the sky, it's amazing! Thanks, Mossif Bros. I don't know if those are the real Mossif Bros or not, but they're probably just, um, I don't know, they're probably just in Lu Luigi's imagination. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do you see that? They are so scared. Where are they running to? What? Shaking beef is rumbling muscles. Where are they running towards exactly? 
There's nothing for them to run towards. Except at the beginning of this dreamy place. We're back at the start of this area. Oh, crap. You know what time it is? What's your problem? I mean... Come on, that th you can't really blame him. He was sleeping in his own peace and quiet. Gotta teach you a lesson. But then Mario and Luigi went out of their way to piss the thing off, wake it up, and try to get it to erupt. It's coming right for us. Does it mean to ram into us? Probably. So uh, let's kind of look at the bottom screen. Luigi, is something happening again? The L mark is shining. I've seen this before. Press the L on, press and hold the L on Luigi's cap. Look at that. Oh, jeez. Look at all those Luigi squirming into Luigi. Gotta help my bro. He's so considerate. Dreamy Luigi's growing again. Oh, man. Here we go. Gotta tilt the DS now. Okay, so the cool thing about these battles is you don't really need to do anything with, like, the... I don't actually have to hold the DS t in order to play this properly. I just gotta use the stylus, so... Um... Hopefully I won't like pull out a cord on accident while I'm trying to do this battle. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, Luigi with that mega powerful hammer action. Luigi! I bet Mario's never been happier to see Luigi like this. Look at that. Oh yeah. Alright, this is gonna be good. This battle, I think, if I do everything correctly, I should be able to do it really quickly, but if not, I'll probably have to redo it a couple of times. But I have, I, I honestly played it like twice yesterday, so I think I'll be good. I died once, so technically I played it three times, so I know exactly what's up. Um, the good thing about battles like this is that every single time we start one, um, you have uh, this guy, what's his name again? Prince Dreambird, he's actually gonna teach you how to battle, so then you get a good chunk of hits on him, with excellent hits, um, as you battle, so, um, it's, it's always good to let him teach you the tutorials, even though you don't really need him. If only there's a way to break his god! Uh-oh. Alright, here we go. Ah, why not try the hammer uppercut? I'm well trained in the hammer uppercuts. Shall I teach you? You're gonna go ahead and say yes. So we're gonna go ahead and touch the hammer icon. And then there's a new hammer thing on our touch screen. It's called the hammer uppercut. So pretty much it's exactly how it sounds. You hit your sword in an upper uh, way. Or not your sword, your enemy. So you're just going to go ahead and slide quickly in the arrow direction to swing the hammer vertically. Boom. And you get yourself an excellent hit. As you can see, it barely put any damage on this monstrosity. It's a volcano. I don't know what that was. What I even said. If it was even a word. I tried saying monstrosity. But it's cool. <laughs> that hammer uppercut launched the foe backwards. So now what we need to do is we need to attack its nose. As you can see, the nose is probably its weak point. I don't know why, but it is. Not for it. Dream Luigi, he, uh, he sprawls defenseless. Work with Mario to unleash a bro's attack. So we're going to go ahead and touch the bros attack icon. There's actually a new bros icon on it, a new move, I mean. It's called the Drill Stomp. So we've learned, like, the drill and the tornado. We've learned so many new moves ever since we're making our way up to Mount Pajamaja. And we're actually going to use one of those moves and attack him with it. Um, so this one I've always had a problem with. Um, so... When I first was doing this last night, I thought you were supposed to like spin it on the arrow and that wasn't the case. The only reason I did really bad was because I, I was doing this move wrong and this is the only way you can kill him really quickly. So the way you're supposed to do it is you're supposed to spin the thing really quickly as many times as possible. And when you do that, you'll get another attack. If you get an okay, it won't attack you again. As you can see, he says, if you make a lot of circles, the arrow will appear again. Then make more circles. So you're going to go ahead and do the same thing again. And then you're going to get a great. And then it's going to go the opposite way. Sometimes it'll start out this way, and then sometimes it'll start out the opposite way. It really depends. Um, so you just got to be prepared, and you can't really try to assume that it's going to start out one way because if you start going that one way and then it's the opposite way you're screwed because it'll go much faster when it's like in full effect without the pausing into tutorials now spin in the other direction be ever mindful all right and then we got ourselves an excellent hit and as you can see it put like a good one third of his damage we dealt a clean like 10% of his damage, 20, 15% of his damage, I could say. When the drill stomp ends, Mario will flag and need rest. 
as with the with, with the rhythm mushrooms. Um, you won't be able to use bro attacks for a bit, so um, make use of them wisely. All right. So I'm hoping that I won't actually need to heal Luigi at all. Um, as you can see, I will show you all of his attacks right now. I think the first one's when he tosses rocks at us. Um, so we need to knock it back. This is actually very easy. I never really had an issue with this move. Sometimes he will hit me if I, like, screw up, but I don't think I will. Um, and there you go. Later on, the things will go a lot faster, so just be prepared for that. Anyways, guys, it's a lovely Saturday. Um, and I'm playing some Mario and Luigi. It's very nice. So, let me know, what do you guys think of these battles? Like, do you guys like them? For those of you who've never actually played the game, what do you think of battles like this? I personally love them. Like, I've played almost all the Mario and... I've played every single Mario and Luigi game, and I've never, like, seen anything like this. I honestly didn't even know that this was a part of the Mario and Luigi Dream Team game. So, just to have, like, something this cool and unique in this game is awesome. Um, another thing... I never know how to get excellent hits with the jump. For some odd reason, I can never perform an excellent hit, which blows. Uh oh, oh god, this is this is the worst part of the battle. So what you need to do is you need to slide the thing that way to push him back. Oh god, you don't even know how hard I'm sliding this thing. It's really, really fast. But there you go, we flipped him over. Mario is good to go. And it looks like we can go ahead and attack him with the bros attack, so hopefully I won't screw this one up. Okay, which way is he going? Alright, we got a good. Okay, we got another good. Come on, give us an excellent- Ah, oh, come on! So since we only got two goods, we uh, couldn't get the third attack in. It's because it was going the opposite way. I honestly assumed it was going to go the other way because usually it doesn't go that way until the end of the battle. I mean, I will know that I know this because I've played this a couple of times, but apparently not. Apparently it's all random, but that's cool. We're going to go ahead and... Ah, oh, come on! So when he does attack you like that, Mario will go flying off. It's fine, though, because Mario needed to rest anyway, so it's not like it matters. We're going to go ahead and attack him with the hammer uppercut. Woo! I'm really good at getting excellence with these. They're really easy. My only issue is getting excellence or even greats with, like, this move right here. I don't know how, so if you know how to do it, let me know. Because, see, I got an okay. Am I, like, flinging it too early? Am I doing it a little too late? Should I let Luigi power up a little more? I honestly don't know, but I know if you land in excellent you get another jump now I'm getting superheated he said I'm gonna get superheated what are you man ghetto he's probably really ghetto a ghetto uh, volcano all right so he has layers on him now this is the worst part actually it's like whack the mole oh man I got hit by it like three times but I, I don't know how to get it I don't know how to do it really fast it's kind of like tap tap or like guitar here where you have to like hit the notes on rhythm if you don't then you obviously get hit but there you go Mario's back he was only gone for literally one turn or a couple turns actually but that's good because now that he's back we can actually attack him now that he has like three layers of volcanoes on him the way we have to attack him is differently we have to use the hammer chop in order to knock these volcanoes off of him so we have to go boom we got a great which is very good Great's almost as good as excellent. Plus, it's not like we damage him when we attack him like that. But he's gonna go ahead and uh, sometimes he will get like that. That'll happen, and he will restore some health. But and then he'll start attacking you. But this is really easy too when you knock back these blocks. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. I did it way too early. Oh my god, I did it way too early. I screwed it up big time. I never should have screwed that up. Like, screwing that up is, like, really, really critical now. It's gonna make this battle a lot harder. But that's okay, we can still come back from it. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get rid of this second part. Get rid of that. And then that should launch on his head and deal a little bit of damage. And then get him to become dizzy. Flip over. And that is the perfect chance for us to go ahead and jump on him. Alright, here we go. Okay, so I got it good. So maybe I'm doing it a little bit too early. So maybe I should let it recharge a little more. Before I uh, go ahead and assume. Uh, and, and jump on him. Because I always think I'm doing it too late. Is he going to charge at me? Oh, we have to knock it back. Alright, this is the part where it gets a little bit more trickier. See, oh, come on, bro. Is he going to charge at me right now? 
Doesn't look like it. Mario's back. So I guess I'm gonna heal. Um, I really didn't want to heal in this battle, but it looks like I have to. Once again, guys, I warned you at the beginning of this video, I wasn't that good at this. Uh, I'm still getting used to this whole dreamy battle. It's something that we don't do often. This is only the second time we've done this. So, um, I'm still really getting used to this. So, forgive me for my crappy gameplay. It's not, like, excellent. But I got an excellent right there, which is good. So, we almost got all of our health restored. I remember the first time we did this, um... Prince Dreamboat let us actually restore health all the way to the top. We kept doing it until we actually had full health. But I guess now it's changed um, since it's like the second time we've done this. But yeah, what's he going to do now? Is he going to shoot? Oh, God. Oh, come on, dude. I don't, I don't know how to hit those perfectly. Should I wait until they reach the circle or should I try to hit them before the circle? I don't really know. But whatever he's going to do right now, it's probably not good. Okay, so I need to definitely get rid of these, hopefully by getting an excellent. We got a good, that's terrible. Alright, so what's he going to do now? He's going to restore some health, probably. Maybe restore some health, yep. And then he's going to shoot some balls in our face. Oh man, this is not good, because he's like regenerating health now. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay. Okay, I need to I need to focus now. I'm really doing bad. Ah oh, man, I don't know why I'm doing so terrible right now. Like even the first time I played this, I wasn't doing this bad. Okay, so we got both of them to get knocked off, and that dealt a decent chunk of damage. But we need Mario, that's what we need, we need Mario. Because we've only done one spin attack on him, which is really, really bad. We got an okay, god, that is terrible. Alright, where are you, when are you coming back, Mario? We need your love! Okay, he's probably gonna charge at me right now. That's probably what it's gonna be. Uh-oh. Okay, this is, this is gonna be easy. Even though it's probably the most painful thing to do, I still got this! Oh, there we go. Okay, we flipped him over. We need Mario now. Mario, you need to get your butt over here. Okay, he's back. Now, the real question is, do I want to restore a health or do I want to attack him? I'm probably going to attack him because I feel like he's gaining too much health on us. Alright, please go the way I want you to. Okay, we got a good... We got great, come on. We got another great. There we go. Nice. So we took like a good 20% of his health right now. Um, so that was just off of one attack. So imagine if we did this like every single time. Uh, we probably would have killed him by now. But it's because I keep getting hit and Mario keeps getting deflected off of me. Um, I always screw up. But I need to focus now so I'll shut up. All right, there we go. See how that last hit went really slow? So they try to throw you off by making the last hit fly at you really slow because you're so used to a specific pace of like how you hit these things. So, um, yeah, uh, let's just go ahead and do the hammer uppercut. Boom, excellent hit on this guy. Oh, okay, so things are starting to look up right now. Uh, unfortunately, Mario is still out of business. Okay, come on. We got a good. Maybe I should let it charge up a little more. Um, okay, what next? What's he gonna do next? Whatever he does next, I honestly need to dodge it. Oh, jeez. What the heck's going on here? Oh, he's, he's getting damaged because his health is really low right now. Mario, are you back, bro? Oh, jeez. Look at that thick layer, dude. Okay, come on. Oh, come on. That is terrible. What the fudge? Okay, so I definitely need to heal. Otherwise, I will end up dying. Oh, crap. What's he gonna do now? Please, dude. For the love of everything, don't attack me. 
Okay, we definitely need to do bros right now. Restore some health, just a little bit. Alright, come on. Ah, oh, that was two mushrooms that I wasted. Alright, there we go, great, so... Not bad, I guess. We're about at the same health right now. Um, I don't know what he's gonna do next to attack me. I just hope it's not that same attack move that he usually does. Because that's what usually kills me, I guess. Um, but I need to deflect these things back. There we go. Not bad. See, those weren't that bad. The only thing that I have is just when he shoots those little balls at us. And then we have to hit them, like whack the mole. Those are the only things that throw me off. Alright, we got one off. Oh, we got two of them off. Nice, so that will actually hit hurt him a little bit too. Is he going to tip over? Nope, he did not tip over. So I don't even know what he's going to do to attack me next. Oh, come on, please. No! See, that went really slow. Okay, that was really slow. So, which is why I was able to attack them all. I'm not complaining, but it was definitely much slower than the ones before. I, I know for a fact. Which is why I was able to, like, hit them all perfectly. Alright, we're gonna attack this guy one more time. And then we'll be able to deal some good damage on him. Hopefully this will be the last hit. If I can get, like, three greats, or two greats and an excellent with the spin attack moves, I'll definitely be golden. Um... Oh, come on, man. Come on, you cheapskate. Okay, cool. He's gonna attack us like this, so... Ah, oh, come on. Oh, push him back! Oh, Luigi, you got this, dude! Ah, oh, come on! Ah, oh, this screen is way too small, man. Ah, oh, God. And Mario's back in action, so... What does that mean for me? I'm gonna just stock up on mushrooms. And drag out this battle even more. Oh, come on. Two mushrooms, are you kidding me? Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, oh, this is going really slow. A lot slower than I thought it was gonna go, but... I guess that's okay. I guess it's good to take our time and defeat him in the end rather than just rushing it out and dying multiple times. It worries me because like even when battles like this, when you do die, you can't you don't have the option to change the difficulty to something like easier unless you die in like an outworld battle, like something that isn't in the dream world. I guess if it's a battle like this, you can't you don't have that option, which is unfortunate because it makes me worried about how like the the Bowser boss battle at the end or if there's an Antasma battle like this, how like hard they'll be. All right, here we go. All right. Come on, little guy. He's gonna charge at me. Okay, this, this time I'm gonna make sure I get him. There we go. I don't know why I was thrown off by the last time he did it. I shouldn't have been, because it was it's really easy to throw him like that. I guess I wasn't doing it properly. Okay, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and attack him, and hopefully this is the final attack that we do before we kill him. Yes, two greats. Alright, good, good. We're so close, guys. I can feel victory. I can already taste it. What's he gonna do now? He's just gonna do this. We're gonna play some baseball. Oh, 
Ah, oh, come on! I knew it! I called it! I knew that was gonna happen. I knew he was gonna attack me and I was gonna miss that hit. God, that's so bad. I wonder what happens if I... Oh, I'm not even gonna bother attacking him like that. I'm just gonna do this way, this uppercut. Oh, that was okay. Alright. I don't even think we need Mario right now. If I can get an excellent... Please, for the love of everything, holy... No! I need an excellent hit. Well, whatever. I mean, I'm pretty sure he's really close to dying right now because, like, there's only so much health that you can take from him before, like, the game allows, like, stops you from being able to take any more of his health. But this is good because I'm able to get this then. Come on. There we go. We flip him over. Just like that. Alright, Mario. Are you back yet? I think he's ready to go. Alright, guys. This is it. This is the final hit. Almost 30 minutes later. And we're going to kill him. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, I think that's it. Please be, please be the end. Dreambird, where are you? Apparently that wasn't the end. God. Okay, so this is definitely going to be the end. This is the final hit that we need to do. So we just need to make sure that we get all the hits perfectly. Alright, come on. Alright, is this it? Is this it? I, I couldn't tell you. I'm pretty sure... Ah, oh, it's not it. All right, whatever. We're so close. I can already taste victory. Come on, this has to be it. This has to be it. Still not. Maybe I have to attack him like a certain way. Maybe I have to attack him with Mario before I'm able to kill him. Unless this is it. Dream Bert, where'd you go? Yeah, it looks like I have to attack him like that with Mario, doing the spin jump. Because we've taken way too much of his health. He shouldn't have this much health left. Oh, uh, Streambird's gonna pop out now. Okay, so yeah, watch. I'm, I'm gonna prove to you that, like, God, this is so stupid. You have to actually attack him like that. What if somebody sucked and didn't know how to do the drill stomp? Like, what would the game make him do? Watch, it's going to take absolutely none of his health. Oh, it did. It took a little bit. But there you go. That's it. That's all it took. Because that's how much health he needed before we can finally attack him with the final blow. It is time. The foe is weak and ripe to defeat. All right. So we're going to do the finishing blow. The fin It's actually called finishing bros. Aim with the 3DS. Ah. Uh. Okay, here we go. And launch into the sky. Oh man. All right, here we go. Swing the beast. All right. Where's the foe? Oh, there it is. Uh-oh. Can we get it? We got this. We got this. Yes. Oh. We still got an excellent. I'm pretty sure I, like, butchered that, but we still got an excellent for some reason. And that's fine by me, honestly. Because I'm just glad that we finally defeated this boss. I warned you guys at the beginning of this video that it was going to take a while, and that it wasn't good at it, and I stood corrected. Uh, I was hoping that I, I, I would do much better than I did the first time around, but apparently that wasn't the case. So, um, yeah, it's, it's all good, though, in the end. I'm just glad we got that over with. Whew, all right, so it looks like we can finally reverse our 3DS back to the way it was. Flip it back to normal, and Luigi can uh, go back to being the way he was. Phew, a heated battle. The dreamy portal is finally back. The eruption is making Luigi sleep less soundly. We can return to the real world. But what awaits us? Let us make haste. 
Alright guys, that will conclude today's episode of Mario and Luigi Dream Team. In the next episode, we will finally exit Dreamy Mount Patch Imagia and hopefully leave this place once and for all because I'm pretty sure you guys are sick of this. We've been here for a good... F oh, I, I want to say like 10 episodes, but I don't really know if it's really been 10 episodes or not since we've been in Mount Patch Imagia. But we've been here for a while, so it's time for us to make our way to a new area of this game. So thank you all so much for watching. Remember, hit that like button down below and leave a comment if you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.